like show the people how you would actually like intro if it was your own comedy special. Oh, okay, let's do it right now. On. You ready, Jesse? Ready. Cue my theme music. And the applause. Hey. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? What's going on, everybody? What do you get whenever you mix salmon with some good old Nutella? What? Salmonella. Ugh. Uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> Pow. But you know, it's really crazy though because I know that smoking gets a really bad rap. Like everyone's saying don't smoking and you know, like don't smoke because it kills. But I never figured out, smoking kills, why does it cure salmon? <laughs> oh my goodness. Was it a bad idea? All right guys, today in the kitchen we are making a recipe that is just in time for the summer grilling season. We are making some burgers, but not just any burger, salmon burgers, but not just any salmon burger. So hold on, we are making jalapeno cheddar salmon burgers. I've been dreaming about this recipe and I know exactly how to put it together and this is an eggless recipe. I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. All right, first thing we're gonna do is make our salmon mince. So I've taken some center cut salmon fillets. We're gonna place them in a high powered blender. Take off the skin, boom. We need this to be extra, extra fine because we're going to be adding in a lot more ingredients. We want this to be pulverized. And we know that when we do that, it becomes very, very sticky like paste. And that's exactly what we want. Now with the remaining fillet, we are going to mince it ourselves, so I'm gonna take off the skin. This is an optional step, but I like to know what I'm eating, and so when it's minced like this, people really don't know. So what we're gonna do is just chop this up into larger chunks. You'll be able to see that it's salmon. Then we're gonna fold that into our burger mix. Boom. Now we're gonna add in the rest of the ingredients. We're gonna add in some panko. This is some chickpea crumble. I'm gonna add in some green onion, some smoked paprika, that flavor some salt, some black pepper, and remember the cheese. Don't forget the cheese. And then some jalapeno. In goes the jalapenos. Now let's mix everything together. Fold, fold everything together. Use a spatula to do this. At the same time, you're mixing all the ingredients. Beautiful. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. You're beautiful, it's true. Wait, is that right? It's true? Yeah. Yeah. Now we are going to divide these up into some mega salmon burgers. Massage it and then create your burger. All right, now even though these are sticky and ready to go, I really advise you to store these in the fridge for about 20 minutes before cooking them up on the grill or in the skillet. And after about 20 minutes, Get these bad boys out. They're looking amazing. Fire up a nonstick skillet, um, put it on high heat, and we're gonna spray it. And we're gonna cook this the same way that we would normal salmon. We're gonna sear it and then bake it. Natural oils in there, love that sound. They're pretty fragile, so flip them over. There we go. We're gonna put it on a baking tray lined with some parchment. We really wanna make sure that the inner part of it gets really nice and hot, so that way it melts all that cheese. So we're gonna bake this in the oven for about six to eight minutes, maybe even 10 minutes at 420. And instead of albumin oozing out, we got cheddar oozing out of these. Oh man, what a delight. Oh my God. All right, Jesse, I have an idea. We're gonna take one of these, put it on this beautiful mound of avocado. Let's smoke it. Oh! These are looking so good, I just couldn't help it. I just cannot help it. Ready, Jesse? In three, two, one. Isn't that smell amazing, bro? It smells and looks so good. <laughs> Jesse, I'm not sure about you, man, but I've never been so ready to taste something before. Man, look at that. Oh, man. Look at that cheese pull inside. Oh. I will do the hard part for the internet. I will do it. Here we go. Oh. I think this may be my new favorite burger recipe. I gotta just taste it and make sure it's okay for people. Mm. Mm. You finished the video. 
You get that smoky flavor. Hmm. Is that a home run? Or maybe just, is it a, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what you think, bro. It may not be a home run to you. I'm gonna go and sample it again, because I think, oh my God, look at that. Oh my God. Mm-hmm. I love it. You love it, bro? I love it, man. It's definitely up there for burger alternatives, man. Yeah. Yeah. This is one that you can put at your barbecue, your cookout, your family reunion. If people don't grab this one first, something's wrong. Maybe something wrong with the way you prepared it. Mm. But you made it just the same way that I did. Oh my God, this one you can't lose. And then adding to that, the smoky flavor, you just, I feel like I'm outside somewhere. Like I could be like on a beach, enjoying this wonderful, delicious salmon burger. All right guys, that is it for today's video. Hope that y'all enjoyed it. Wow, I want you to go run and make this recipe and let me know how you customize it. Just keep it calorie conscious. If you like videos like this, smash that like button below and remember to subscribe to the channel and don't forget to ring the bell, ding, 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 so that way you can be notified every time we post content like this here in the Fit Maker Kitchen. All right, y'all, thank you for watching. Until next time, keep it healthy, but of course, never ever boring. Boom! Bye, peeps.